Well, I'm back to my Victoria 2 Vuvuzuela HFM playthroughs. It's now in 1925 as we're getting our asses kicked in World War II as fucking Greece and Austria-Hungary had to invite all their freaking allies in out of nowhere fucking fight Germany, Turkey, Austria-Hungary, Greece, Netherlands, all of them. And of course, my allies in France and America are too stupid to f know, you know, fight a war in realistic terms like invade the Netherlands, not invade Turkey and Greece first because the mountains and all. No, they can't do it. They can't think smart. Jesus Christ. And of course, can't really do anything right now, too. Except just try and survive. As Turkey's coming in, taking over, get, taking back all the gains I took in Greece, and they're starting to kick us out. And of course, they've pretty much kicked me out of um, some, kicked me out of the Arabian Peninsula. So I take our stuff over in Greece, just where I, you I mean, not take my stuff at, over in Egypt. Oh great! Now Germany's invading my camp, my um, co Congo colonies now too. Just lovely, and they're invading up there too. What a surprise! Now they're throwing their um, colonial might at me now because they're too busy fighting France, who they've just destroyed. It's, oh my god, now they add more. Oh, Ron, where's that? I'm saying, what is. Wait, I think I know that's in. Um, I think that's up here. Yeah, okay, so they want more France, okay. So right now, I'm actually in the better position than France and America because God, they're gonna get destroyed if they if they lose this war. All I'm gonna get is like, um, hey, I'm about to become a great power again. Looks like right now, yippee! But I'm in bad shape right now. But right now, all I had to do is um, great war capitulation, but nothing like severe like America, like lo France, like losing territory and all of that. Maybe I can hopefully try and kill off their troops down here. And then you're going to have to go down here and help, too. <sighs> Fucking crazy. It's absolutely crazy how this war happened. Who the fuck would have fought trying to take over freaking territory from Greece would start World War II. That was not my intention whatsoever. And I bet if I had my entire navy back, maybe I would maybe it would have been more likely for them to give up. Six War of American aggression. Oh, rebels or whatever it was. I'll accept but you're gonna surrender like whenever yeah, see. Take over my colonies and all. That's all I fucking need. Great! The terrible dice roll! And no... Uh, no... Oh, shit. Come on. Please win. Please, please, please win. Please! Come on. Hurry. Yes, we won. But, of course, now we're going to get destroyed because they have gas attack. Although, thankfully, they're on the offense, so maybe I have a chance to survive, hopefully. Terrible dice roll. Come on. Oh my god, they have a very good general too. Oh my god, now they resupply themselves. That's all I have in F right now, but we're still winning technically, thankfully. Which I'm actually very surprised how we're winning. They, that's probably why, because they have only art um, infantry. They have no support, whereas I do with all my inf artillery I got left. Oh my god, I can't believe you're not buying goods that you need. Stockpile already. Come on. Maybe if, if we can hurry up and kill them off before they send troops down here, maybe I have a chance to still win right here and get some victory. But the laws have been pretty much equal right now. And, of course, if they're equal, I'm going to lose out because I have less men. Oh my god, these terrible dice rolls, but they already got a plus seven advantage. Yay, good dice roll right there, but still in a very bad shape. God, now my losses are double now. 
very good dice roll, but have a massive disadvantage still. And of course, there's a terrible dice roll again. Whoa! When the hell did Britain get all that? Okay, nothing's going on over there. And of course, they're not invading America. They, America and Venezuela for me pretty much is probably going to be a giant fortress. All my shit problems going to be in Africa. Like right here, of course. And of course, I keep losing more colonies and shit right here. And suction can't fucking retreat either. much provinces are they invading at once? Better work on my defense in case they try and come over here. I'm actually surprised my troops would survive this long. It would be nice if they survived much earlier. And of course they lost. But hey, that was a massive loss for Turkey, too. They lost over twice as many men to me. Oh my god! It went up to plus one! Holy sh- Wait. Okay, France lost. They got kicked out, so technically, we're winning now, actually. But France got destroyed. Okay, now, unfortunately, they're going to be on the advantage now, so let's see. They want it. Okay, so... Right now, there's really no war goal. So if they want, if 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 they want to win, they're gonna have to come over here and beat us. And they're not gonna invade America. That's for damn sure. And they're probably not gonna be able to invade me because we're too damn good. Hey, more prestige. Thankfully, I'll help out. Cause I'm on the verge of being a great power again. That can help out. But thankfully, they're not over here yet. Yeah, America is just a juggernaut. Uh-oh, Germany's here. I think I'm going to have to start supplying my navy because I might have to start moving troops back and forth. Okay, they're leaving right now. It's now into July, almost into August. Well, we, um... Technically, got a new battle plan we're going to have to do now since I can't invade them now. My African colonies are on their own. Right now, my main goal in my new plan is to just hold my line from Germany. Just like America needs to hold their line. New plan free. Of course, that was a terrible line I drew right there. It's so small you can barely see it. Uh, I guess raise the minimum wage. Well, we are winning, actually, as you can see. We are winning the war now, believe it or not. Once France got kicked out, we were winning. But they won't accept the peace offer. Well, that's, well, that's right. I'm trying to make a peace in my favor, so of course they're not going to accept it. They probably won't even accept a white peace. Maybe I can hurry up and get my troops over here because I need to get them out of Haiti for right now. But we are a fortress, so they can't invade us. Well, at least I hope they can't invade us. As we're now into September. Oil production going up. Uh-oh. Wait, 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 wait. Maybe. Maybe I can kill Austria-Hungary's free ships right here. Come on. Maybe we can kill them. Although we're in bad shape ourselves, unfortunately. If we can kill them, that can maybe help our score just a wee little bit. Okay, they've lost ship, but we lost a ship too, unfortunately. Alright, we won, but it wasn't... That was not a very good victory. Jesus Christ, everyone's buying up all the stuff I need. Oh my god, I can't believe I still... They're still fucking invading over there. Oh my god, I can't believe it. They're taking that long to take over that stuff. Great, now we're losing now.
But right now, if Jeremy and all of them were smart, they should try and demand all the all the Afghan stuff right right here that they got. Because if they get that, they're gonna get War Score if they were smart. But looks like they're not right now, thankfully. So that's like my saving grace because the only way now they're gonna really win unless it's a stalemate, like a just a white piece, which you can't do in World in World Wars. One side has the one side. We got the war continues on until one side is completely destroyed. But so the only way, unless they're gonna be do, be smart and do what I said and start demanding all the colonies of mine, they're gonna have to come over here, and they are not gonna beat America. You're not gonna beat America. Look at that. You're not gonna kill America on American soil. You're not. Probably not down here either. You're probably gonna have a better shot with me. But I will throw everything I got to make sure you're not gonna beat me. So. That's what I got to deal with. Fix my relationships. Work on my relationship. Fix my relationship with Argentina. My vast, my um, puppet. Fix relationship with America. Used up all my diplomatic points now. So we're now into November. I have, I literally have no idea what they're doing either. Like, oh. So that's one stupid thing. If they're really smart, they should be throwing everything they got in the rest of their colonies and take them over. But no, they're taking forever for some strange re God knows unknown reason. Well, it went up, so now we're minus three. We were at minus four a second ago. Uh, I wonder if I've built up those forts yet. Oh, oh my God, they're still being built. Come on. Fucking build faster. All right, Peru, ally me. If I can get more allies, I can maybe turn it around, maybe. But we're now in 1926 as we lost another province. I wonder if I could maybe. I don't think I can, though. Yep, I can't because America's the war score leader. Well, like I said, if if they were smart, they should start demanding my colonies over here. That way they get war score and probably win out that way. But unless they do that, they're going to have to come over here. They're not going to kill America. And it's going to be tough killing me and my pu puppet in Argentina because they got a lot of troops down there too. So this war, unless Germany does their shit they're supposed to be doing, this could be a long war that could be years and years and maybe never before it could end. I have no idea. But we're in a lot better situation than it was at the beginning of the year once France got kicked out. But right now we're still not in a good situation. So that will wrap up this episode here. See you guys next time.